Hello and welcome to Simply Solo Playthroughs. I'm the Chipmunk Gamer and we are here with The Mandalorian, a Star Wars card game. This is a deck builder and like most deck builders you want to be able to get rid of your initial cards, pick up more important cards from the purchase pile. You do have a small set of cards over here that can be bought for one, two, and three points if you can't buy anything else. And of course we have our tracker for our health and morale. This can be found on Board Game Geek. It is a retheme of Wiper Salient, which is a really nice game. And you'll see how it works exactly right here because it's the same exact game. And so, here we go. We have our initial five cards. And we have these cards from our... Oh, wow, these are some good cards. Uh, pile to draw from. We have an enemy. The enemies do come in order, and there's no surprises. It's 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, all the way through 12. And they do different amounts of damage. And you can get an awful lot of damage going on very, very quickly. Uh, this game starts falling downhill really quick. One of the problems that it does fall down is you can't get rid of your initial person because you only can do cause two damage. However, you can buy up to six points worth of cards on your very first turn. So we can buy... We're going to buy the Stranger for three. And we will buy a Close Call also for three. And we cannot do anything with that. So that is the end of our turn. But because it is the end of our turn, he will cause one morale damage. I've got the egg. Nasty Fall is a really nice card. It does a lot of damage, but you take damage in the process of that card. So you also get a new person. We can draw and play one more card twice. So we're going to go through all of our cards here. And then these are all attack cards. These are all purchase cards. And we will, for four points, we will go on ahead and buy Friendly Fire. Did not put that out like I'm supposed to. Wow, we tired. Boy, this is might be a very easy game. So we have two, three, four, five points to cause damage. We can get rid of Berg. So this is the Mandalorian. I thought they'd be bigger. This way we only take one damage, but we can also heal up our morale by one. And we will get damage. Oh, were we going to buy anything? Yes, we were going to buy something. So we have six points to purchase. Oh, we bought four. Never mind. We did buy. So we go on ahead and shuffle. So I went ahead and said to draw and play one more card. We do get a new enemy. We will go on ahead and buy for five points We will buy the Z6 jetpack. Train with this. It will make you complete. This is a really nice card because we can return one of these enemies back to the deck. This leaves us with one three points left over. And we cannot buy anything. 
However, friendly fire also can cause some damage. Oh, hey. I am going to go on ahead and retire this card. Because I don't need it anymore. Okay, so we have two, three, four, five, six. We will take care of Toro Kalkin. Notice they keep going up in damage. We also get to heal one morale damage. And we also take one morale damage. Okay, Zian. Uh, we can re heal one morale. It does not matter which order we do these in. Two, four, six points of da of to purchase with. Uh, we will buy a heavy gun. Okay, so then we have one, two. Three, four, five points to do damage with, which we will take out the Stormtrooper. And Zian gets returned back to the top of the thing with our friendly fire card. And that is the end of our turn. Protect the child. And we have one, two, three cards which we're going to be able to draw two more cards. And Zian is back. You ever seen his face? A lady never tells. Okay, so we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So we're going to get rid of Zian right off the bat. We don't need to do any healing. And we have three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Because we don't have a lot of health, I'm going to go on ahead and choose that one. That's the end of our turn. Refill the row. First contact. Mayfield. <laughs> Mayfield, former Imperial sharpshooter. Uh, that's not saying much. I wasn't a stormtrooper, wise ass. Love that line. Okay, so we can retire a card, which we will retire a quick attack. One, two, three, four, five, six, okay. We have the extra card, so we can do three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Get rid of Mayfield. We have two, three, four, five to purchase with. And we're going to protect the child. Um, while that does do one point of damage to me, at this point, it's probably worth the effort. Okay, so we have two, three, um, two, three, six, seven, eight to purchase with. We will buy the guild attack. This is the way. I am not going to be able to retire a card unless I want to retire that, and I really don't want to retire that. So we have two, five, seven, eight. Nine. And that takes care of Fennec Shand. Okay, so. Two, five, six. Since we don't have much in the way of healing health, I will go with first contact. 
Then we do four, five, six, seven, ten. That's enough to get rid of stormtroopers. Boy, I'm making this game look really easy. This game is not quite this easy. Okay, so order of play is important. So we're going to do friendly fire. We're going to get rid of the razor quest. Then we're going to go on ahead and draw and play one more card. Okay, we've got the ATST. So two, four is all we have to purchase with. I'm gonna go with nasty fall. The same reason I went with the other one. Um, I'm pretty healthy, so I'm kind of okay at this point. And I have the jetpack, and I am two, three, four, seven, eight, nine, ten. Like I said, I am making this game look really easy. We have the client, which is the second to last enemy. Okay, so we're going to draw and play another card. That was not quite what I was looking for. So we have three, six, and I'm not going to buy anything. Yeah, I'm not going to buy anything. Okay, so we have 4, 8, 9, 10. We cannot do anything with this. So we're going to lose 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3. Like I said, this gets really quick, goes downhill. Okay, we are going to retire a card from our, which will be the Razor Quest. Crest. We will go on ahead and draw and play one more card. So, nice thing is we're going to be able to get rid of the client. So, let's see what we can do. Three, six, seven. Oh, look at that. 13 points. The client is killed and out. No. Okay, do we can we buy anything? Two, four. We're not gonna buy anything at this point. So we'll go on ahead and collapse the hand. And Moff Gideon is our last opponent. We can draw another card. Eight. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. And that is the game. Moff Gideon is out. And we have won the game. I'm going to include right up here another uh, playthrough of this game, which is not quite so simple and easy. But I hope that you have enjoyed this. Please make sure that you like and subscribe. And I hope that you have an absolutely great day. Please like and subscribe.